Hi, my name is Brad Shook. I'm a senior at Davidson College in North Carolina. My major is computer science with a minor in mathematics. During the RISC program, I've worked in the Auton Lab under Dr. Arthur Dubrowski and Iphigenia Apostolopoulou. My work has focused on uncertainty quantification for image segmentation. In safety critical tasks, such as ones in healthcare and autonomous driving, a model's confidence in its predictions needs to be quantified. This is done through uncertainty quantification, or UQ. However, there is a lack of standardized code and data availability pertaining to UCube, which impedes the progress of research into the topic. Because of this, Google Research created a framework containing state-of-the-art methods, datasets, and evaluation metrics for UQ. This framework does not include, however, any image segmentation code or datasets. In the task of image segmentation, an input image is passed to a model and the output is a segmented image where every pixel is assigned to a class. For example, when given an image from a car dash cam, the model should output a segmented image where pixels are classified as belonging to roads, humans, cars, etc. There are two methods of uncertainty quantification that we have focused on. The first one is ensembling. Ensembling involves bootstrapping data sets from the original data set, then using each bootstrap data set to train a single model. These models then form an ensemble. By aggregating the outputs of each model in an ensemble, we can quantify the uncertainty of the model. The second method is Monte Carlo dropout, or MC dropout. This method involves training a single model, but with dropout layers applied. These dropout layers cause the model to act as a different model each forward pass through the network since a random percentage of nodes will be dropped out each time. By gathering outputs from multiple forward passes through the network, we can quantify the uncertainty of the model. We have based our work on evaluating scalable Bayesian deep learning methods for robust computer vision by Gustafson. This paper focuses on uncertainty quantification for image segmentation using the Cityscapes dataset. Our goal has been to convert their PyTorch implementation of MC Dropout, Ensembling, and the DeepLab v3 model into Google Research's UQ framework. We also have aimed to reproduce the results presented by Gustafson. Evaluation of these methods is still ongoing. However, here are some preliminary results for a single MC dropout model. In the left figure, we see the input image, its true segmentation, the predicted segmentation from our model, and the entropy between the true and predicted segmentation images. The predicted segmentation image demonstrates the model excels at classifying cars, roads, and buildings, but struggles in classifying more minute objects such as road signs. In terms of entropy, we see that the model's uncertainty is minimized where multiple pixels are connected that belong to the same class, like cars. The uncertainty is maximized in pixels pertaining to boundaries between multiple classes. In the right figure, we see the confusion matrix heat map for all the segmentations from a single MC dropout model. This figure confirms what we see in the left figure, which is that the model often misclassifies buildings and cars as other classes. Moreover, roads and sidewalks are frequently misclassified for one another. In the future, we plan to use this work as a foundation for performing anomaly detection. Specifically, we hope to be able to identify minor car accidents from traffic camera footage in order to map the safety of different areas. Additionally, we would like to expand the UQ framework to include more datasets and methods.